Hi everybody, this is Chaya Parkoff, licensed clinical social worker and educator at The Jewish Experience in Denver, Colorado. Today is January 28th, 2022. It's the 26th of the Jewish month of Shvat, and the Parshat Hashavua, the Torah portion of the week, is Mishpatim, which is essentially full of tons and tons of laws, Jewish laws, uh, that Moses, Moshe Rabbeinu, gives the Jewish people. I wanted to offer a little idea this week that perhaps will encourage you and inspire you to learn. So very often we, we give lip service to things, right? We say we're going to do something. We say we're going to learn something. We say we're going to change something. And we don't necessarily do it. It's called we give lip service to it. We say we're going to do it, but we actually don't. Well, I want to give you a spin on lip service. Lip, L-I-P. Learn, internalize, and practice. Learn. This Torah portion gives us tons and tons of things that we can learn about. Maybe pick something, a topic that you have been interested in, that you've always wanted to know about and learn. You can learn with any of us at the Jewish Experience. There are tons of resources online and there's so many opportunities that we offer at the Jewish Experience for you to learn. So learn something. And if maybe there's a topic where you think you know about it or you've learned it once before and it's bothered you, you don't like it, maybe, I don't, I don't understand it. It doesn't make sense to me. I wanna encourage you to learn even more about it. Delve deeper because at some point, the Torah is very, very, very deep and there are many, many, many layers. Keep learning it until you feel like it's something you can connect to. Because if you can't connect to it, likely there's more to it than what has been shown to you. So that's number one, learn. The first letter, I, internalize. Integrate it into you. How is this relevant to me? How can I identify with this? Maybe not directly to me, but how can I think about it in terms of perhaps others? So we need to internalize it, make it relevant to how I think, to how I want to be and how I want to function or what it means to me. P, practice. And I add a second P, patience. Practice it. Practicing your life, these new ideas, these new ways of thinking and acting. And be patient because change takes time sometimes, very often actually. And it takes time to really integrate things and really feel like it has become another P, part of you. So learn, internalize, and practice. And there's so much to learn about in Torah. And we're actually obligated to learn men for its own sake, women, how it's relevant to me. And you know what? It's all relevant, not just keeping kosher, not just laws of Shabbos, not just laws of family life, but avas Hashem, love of God, avas Yisrael, love of people. There's so many different aspects of the Torah that we really do need to know so that we can function in the world as purposefully and as meaningfully and as productively as possible. Good Shabbos.